but still, I think they have to, I'm doing it, I'm doing it, he says I'm moving, I'm doing it, you know, yeah, but the noise on the background, keep talking, now, listen, you know the fish we did yesterday, now, this is the action result, now they are amateurs and they just started, but because they have good parent stock, 2.6, 2.8 kg, 2.6 kg, we're not expecting fish, 45,000, 50,000 ash. And they got just three vats. I was talking about greed yesterday. Now today, we did something. We put the first one, plenty of eggs in one vat. And the other one, a little bit junior, in two vats. Let's see the results. <laughs> first of all, we came in the morning because we were crowding for something, for one reason or the other. The fishes are not moving. Majority are not moving. This small amount, look at everybody. Just, just ten percent on. Too many on that side too. Too many, right? So overcrowding. Now, but let's look at the other one. Where we split it into two. Can you see? In fact, there's some luring like there. Shooters already. You can see? You can see? You can see, you can see all over the place. Black, so go to that black. corner. Right? Because we divided into black, two. Black. And that's why black. you can see. Okay? Now see, look at the other side. No, it's the same thing. Yes. See the sun they shake. No. Some they enter the green side. Okay. Look at the other side too. Same thing. See their green tail. Oh, it's black. Oh, and yeah, some some guys are called that. Of course, they're supposed to be black. This is black. Oh, they're, they're more black. They're more blacks. They're more, they're, they're, they're more blacks than you'll see, green. You will see, you will see a lot of, 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 but you're going to see a lot of blacks later on. Oh my now, God. survival rate here, it's almost about uh, ninety percent or ninety-five percent. But there, we got oh, almost just about two percent. Yeah. <laughs> I'll say we're all doing that in uh, that regard, all because of green. Now, the funny thing is that after the first set of ash, you know, you get a bit uh, greedy and you put them. Let's just manage it in the pond here. Now look at all the ones, the same population that was here, that was transferred here, you found out that they did well. They survived. You can see them moving. Yeah. You can see on, on this side, let me, so let me, I'm saying they are not having black cell, but they're moving. All right, can you see that? Now, same thing because they got, they got space. The disadvantage of the pond here is that uh, we're gonna have some difficulty trying to siphon and the rest later on. But it's okay, the generation there, the generation there that we lost, the ones that we thought were the slow, the slow arching, arching, arching group are the ones that survived because they have more space. So obviously space is a consideration anytime you want to do your spawning. That's the essence no. of this video. Make sure you have enough vats. It's obvious now for the fish we did that we, we just we, we spawn, we could have had about 10 vats spread into the vat. That's why I laugh when I see people buy small, small plastic buckets to spawn like they're doing tilapia production. How many of the buckets are you going to use? It's still all, as far as concerned, kindergarten. And we need to go professional. So these folks started professional, but like I said earlier on, he said on small ashery. But yes, he used giant spray stock. So instead of training them from the backyard perspective, I have to put in some professional, uh, some professional finishing to the whole thing. That's why I'm this late. I'm gonna get back to my hotel and prepare for Lagos tomorrow. Wishing them success. If they get this right, even if it's just a training program, they should eat about a million bucks on these sales alone. Yes, sir. I hope they remember I'm their pastor. I remember to send the offering. <laughs>